Today is Thursday the 9th of August. It's a day I've been looking forward to for the whole year. We're opening up our labs to primary school students and secondary school students to try and show them some of the research that we do here. And we're trying to build a quantum computer here. We can actually build the whole chip in this building. And we wanted young people just to see some of the high technology research that's happening across Australia and here at UNSW Sydney. Uh, this is a terrific day today to welcome school kids to experience some research, uh, broaden their understanding of some science, technology, engineering, mathematics. Uh, to have a look around our labs and uh, we're having a terrific day. Today I'm delighted to be at the University of New South Wales. I'm just having this opportunity to bring students into the university so they can see, they can get a taste of what quantum physics looks like and the role that mathematics has in that. I'm really passionate to show students uh, and parents and teachers that mathematics is for everyone. Even though some people might think, oh, you're a maths person or you're not, I don't think that's true and I'm here to try and convince people of that. So right now around me there are all these great physics experiments happening. So one of the things that's brilliant here is kids get to see it actually happening in front of them and they get to experience it. And with both physics and biology and chemistry and mathematics, all of these sciences really need to be experienced by students for them to appreciate it and really get excited about it. I'm doing work experience for the week here at uh, the Centre for Quantum Computation and Communication Technology. This week we have had a lot of lectures and we've learnt a lot about the quantum physics and quantum mechanics and applications of their technology and it's been super exciting because we've learnt lots and lots in our few days here and I can't wait to come back in a few years and study. The St Mary's class has been named after Michelle Simmons. We have recognised the work that Michelle Simmons had done. This is the future of our world and to be able to show our small children how amazing it is here, it really shows them what science and maths does for our world. The fact that we are working at the cutting edge of computer technology and working at the size of an atom is just absolutely fascinating. Don't you agree, Danny? I definitely agree, but we can do it. <laughs> you have the opportunity to create that future with the skills you're learning now, and Australia needs absolutely every single person here to get into STEM education, in my opinion, and, and it's never been a better time. Thank you very much. Today has been absolutely amazing. At the beginning of the year, I had this dream of trying to open up the labs to bring school children in, and I wanted it to be all ages. I wanted to go all the way down to primary up to secondary. I didn't know what they would like. I didn't know what, you know, whether they'd really understand what we're doing, but it's been incredible. I love it when students ask questions where they're just genuinely curious. They don't care what anyone thinks. They just want to understand something. And so we encourage that. We had huge numbers of questions throughout the day. I'm incredibly proud of my team. My team, you know, have not taken primary school children through before. I sat in and listened to some of them presenting. You know, I couldn't feel prouder of them, but just the whole day's been great. You know, this is what university is about bringing young people in, getting to see real research right at the forefront, getting the students here to teach young people. It's great, couldn't be better.